Back in action, we're back in the action, boys. Hey man, we're gonna keep this short and sweet today. Not that I really want to, you guys know I love to talk. <laughs> Celebratory dinner for my boy, I'm taking him out to uh, whatever the hell, I don't even know yet. Probably Applebee's or something, he just graduated his exam or whatever you freaking scholars say. Anyway, boys, you guys know I like myself a good mystery box before we get into this, which could hold some icebox in it, boys. I'm so freaking stoked. I'm feeling like a winner today, bro. I just freaking paid $10,000 for a damn NFT and I don't even feel bad about it. It's gonna double. I'm not gonna say what one it is because I'm not financially advised or smart, but hey. First though, guys, if you guys want to give this video a huge thumbs up, comment down below. 500 thumbs up within the day. I'm giving away a free real gold rope chain. I'm looking around here. It's in one of these boxes. Uh, good luck with that, boys. Instagram's right here. I love when you guys message me. I try to always hit you guys back too. Like, you guys are so dope. Honestly, I think I do a really good job of it. So if you guys want to chill, talk, or just send me some links to things you think I should purchase, that's awesome. Boys, let's get into this damn mystery box. Uh, long story short, boys, I like my mystery boxes as I just said. eBay is generally the place I go. Now I unbox a ton of mystery boxes all the time off camera to do with like basketball cards and stuff like that. They'll just throw some random stuff in and have a long list of what you can get and the top being the one you really want. Maybe like a LeBron James rookie card. This was the same sort of thing when I found a jewelry mystery box on eBay. Now here's why I'm really stoked. These guys, I actually don't think I'm going to get scammed for once because they've had a ton of sales. They deal with jewelry plus they're like feedback on there is like 97% or 97.99% I'm pretty sure which is so sick. Boys they had a long list on there just as I said the basketball card people do and there's a bunch of fake jewelry you're gonna get something for $100 however as the list goes down it gets a lot harder to get this piece but they had stuff from like Tiffany Co or something don't care a bunch of girls stuff but they also had as one of like the main prizes a piece from Icebox a watch in fact. So boys I'm so stoked let's get into this $100 freaking dollar mystery box. I can already tell right now there is something in it, but I, I hate how they packed it. That actually pissed me off. I freaking got in the mail. I'm like, bro, I'm actually gonna flip out. So if it's smashed or something, well, I guess you don't know, smash jewelry. Thinking of that jar of farts I bought off eBay the other day. Video uh, somewhere on YouTube. <laughs> that thing smashed real quick. I'm still stepping on glass in my room, by the way. It's still farts everywhere. <laughs> Anyway, boys, uh, we gotta get into it. I'm actually already five minutes late for picking my boy up. Check out this jacket I freaking found in my closet. I totally forgot I had this thing. It says name and then brand. Shout out to the company that sent me this. Revelations, something like that. Diamond tester engaged. God only hopes that we can get something that we need to diamond test. Mystery box. Now, ah! Frick, I didn't think about that. You don't want to be stabbing the piece because you can already hear it's jiggling around in there and it sounds like a chain, bro. Where's my knife? Now, here's the thing, boys. You, you, this is what we're really going to do, actually, as I open this up right now. This is what we're really going to do. If this turns out to be icebox, unless it's like something really crazy, I'm probably going to have to keep it, boys. Like, don't get mad at me for that. But unless it's something really freaking crazy, uh, a thousand thumbs up down below to the person that guesses what's in this. That doesn't make sense. How do we do that? Thousand thumbs up down below, I give it away if it's icebox. Possibly. <laughs> like maybe. <laughs> or if you guess it right, like the company that it's from, I, I can't even list any more companies. I remember Tiffany & Co and I think some other girl ones. I just remember icebox. You guess that right and you get the piece. How, how about that? All right, boys, let's go. This is the weirdest way to ever open a box. And fuck you. Yep, see exactly. What the fuck? that bro what the hell is that oh look but we have a watch did i just freaking say oh my god disclaimer i gotta take this off bro i'm getting hot i think i just said that it's freaking a watch from my spots now i'm just getting all jumbled i can't remember what the hell i said and i'm now thinking i didn't remember right boys holy f I swear to God, first off, I did not hit them up saying I'm a YouTuber doing a YouTube video. I did not do that. That's scummy. I have done that in the past. No, maybe I don't know. I don't think I have for a mystery box. Anyway, I did today. Holy f I saw a watch and I saw diamonds. Now the chances of me. Okay, let's just go. Your stupid damn beads. Okay, if it's an ice box, it can't be ice box. I think they'd actually pack it legitimately. Oh, dear Lord. Holy f it's diamond. I'm trying to just think about what I just saw. That looks f AP like, bro. I just slammed my fingers on the table with that. Ah! Okay, well, it's not bad. I mean, it was a hundred bucks. Damn it. I really thought for a second, I was really apping myself up that we got an ice box. Boys, we didn't. Um, I can just, I haven't even. It's a pin time quartz 
watch. Honestly, a hundred bucks, if somebody wants this, I think we could do this as a giveaway or something like that. For sure. Yeah, no, I can tell just by the diamonds right off the- God damn it, I really thought we might win today. I don't care too much, like, hey, it's ice bucks, whatever, I've got my jewelry, you know what I mean? But that would be an amazing freaking title. We got the f jackpot, bro, but we didn't. Now, I can tell by the diamonds right away. Damn! First off, this is something AliExpress, uh, like 100%. I've seen many like this, if not owned some very freaking similar to this. Boys, yeah, you can tell by the freaking diamonds right away. They're just glued in, they're not set. I'm not a professional though, so we're still gonna freaking diamond test it just for the goof, but yeah, no. Dude, you look actually closer, and the rest of it on the watch, yeah, they're not gonna do this with the damn expensive watch, bro. It looks like a damn AP cup! <clears throat> now I'm all sweaty. I smell like sh**. Now I'm going to dinner at probably Applebee's. And sometimes the servers there are kind of nice. You want to look the part <laughs> as you eat at Applebee's. I don't know, but it's a fact. Anyway, no, at the, at the side there, those aren't even diamonds, bro. That's just like bumpy metal. So 100% not real. We got the diamond tester engaged. Watch her say it's freaking real. This diamond tester is the worst. Oh wow, yeah nothing. At the very least it moves up a little, yeah we're f***ed. Well it's a hundred bucks, I'm not too bad. Honestly, it could have been a lot worse. I wish it was a lot worse, cause that just got me so amped up that it was the damn watch from Icebox. Although I doubt that watch that they were gonna give from Icebox would have diamonds on it. That doesn't make any sense at all. That would be such an expensive mystery box. Anyway, there we go. Well we freaking screwed up this time. However, I'll give it away, I don't need it. Uh, appreciate y'all for watching. I gotta fly, bro. I gotta, I gotta really dip. Uh, appreciate y'all. Blah, blah. This video will be up tomorrow because I can't edit today. Peace. <laughs> it's still a mystery box. I'm not mad. It was fun. Until I got.